Welcome back to Valar. We have Disney Sidekicks. Time to kick it into hero mode board game here. Got it for $4 from Ross. $4 for a board game. It's supposedly new. It's a good deal to me. I don't know anything about this board game at all, but looks like it has decent components. So it's licensed by Disney, made by Spin Master Games, it looks like. We're going to open it up. It's just an unboxing, because I'm sure it's quite a bit to do from cards and board and dice. Again, I don't know anything about this game. We're just going to take a look at it component-wise. And we'll glance at the instructions. So you have, what do you have here? Lumineer, Flora, Fiona, Merryweather, Tinkerbell, Timon and Pumbaa, Abu, Gaston. No, I was like, I was like those aren't <laughs> side... I mean, these are sidekicks. The villains are Gaston, Melissa Fett, Captain Hook, Scar. And Jafar. Game has Scar in it. And Maleficent, so that's cool. Alright, let's open it up here. Rule book. That's pretty heavy. Let's see. Components. Castle and a bridge. I gotta build some stuff. I don't wanna build anything. Psychic sets. Each player uses one of the set specific setup, blah blah blah, power cards, tokens. So, decent amount of stuff going on here. Doesn't look too much though once it's set up. Doesn't look like it's too bad, maybe. Gotta go all the game, cooperate to collect, unlock the castle locks, rescue the captured heroes, okay. Well, I guess it's a co-op game. So, again, this is an unboxing. I'm just thumbing through the instruction booklet here. Uh, it's very, it's got, okay, so pretty much looks like it ends right here. These are scenarios. So you have different game board setups. Two to three players, then you have a four player setup. That's kind of interesting. So fewer spaces, more spaces. Not a huge difference. Summary of a turn. Danger phase. Villagers appear. Danger rises. Enemies approach. Enemy rolls. Then you go to the action phase. You move, attack, unlock, rescue, rest. Sidekick rolls. Okay. Pretty sure it's going to be like pretty good components. This feels pretty good already. That's a lot of tokens. <laughs> I don't... I'm not a huge fan of a huge amount of tokens. Um, maybe this is just one page of what it looks like. Definitely going to leave this as is. Oh, man. Okay, that's not bad. That's just the castle that you're going to build. It's good size miniatures. These are really pretty good size. I mean, they're just plastic, you know, single colored. We can tell who everybody is. Definitely Maleficent. Some pretty good there. I don't know if like if you pick the hero it has to do with what's gonna happen next. So Illuminator has some powers here. It says on your turn, you may re-roll the attack die once per attack. You can spend a star to do so on another psychic's turn so you can help somebody out. Okay. Charlie Roger there. We have a pretty decent sized stack of cards. Eerie silence. Choosing psychic to gain one of a star token. Add an exclamation, whatever that means, to your space and each space adjacent to you. I don't know. Okay, whatever that means. So I'm gonna pull all these out, but they look pretty good. The castle looks like it's probably pretty easy to assemble. Just a couple parts. Maybe we'll do it, maybe we won't. Uh, I'm hoping I said one dice. Let's look at the components here, because there's a uh, yeah, that's a little worrisome. Hold on. Let's put that back. What is that instruction booklet? There we go. Components, page two.
Okay, just one attack dice. I thought I got shorted some dice there the way it looked. Alright, let's open the board. Let's see how it looks. Nice colorful board. Here are your spaces. It's a, you guys can do actions on, I'm guessing. I have a P2 here, P1, player one, player two, I'm guessing. It's a nice looking board. The colors really look good. Uh, it's not too much going on. There's like a village down here, something there. Your castle's going to go here. So maybe it's not too much to it. Once you start playing, like I said, I've never played it for $4. I think it's worth the pickup, and hopefully I'll get around to playing it one day. So that is Disney's Sidekicks. Quick unboxing. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.